Hey guys, how's it going? Rocky Cerrone here, and thanks for tuning in to today's guitar lesson. Today, I'm going to have a lesson on uh, some fundamental skills that anybody at any stage can uh, implement into their guitar playing and, and really, really help improve and help you um, overcome some of the challenges you're having with your playing. Uh, what I'm talking about is building finger strength and finger dexterity. Um, especially for beginners who really have never played or have, uh, haven't picked up the guitar in a really long time, uh, it's especially important to uh, build the strength up in your fingers so you can actually play and, and hold the chords and do the scales and the solos and, and do everything correctly with the proper technique. Uh, you may not, or th this may come as a surprise to some people, but you can actually really hurt yourself. You can really hurt your wrist, you can hurt the muscles in your forearm, you can hurt the muscles in your hand and your finger, and uh, you can damage stuff pretty bad if you don't take the proper care and you don't build the strength up that you need to do the, f to do the physical and mechanical things that is required of your hand and your arms and, and your body. So. This is something that, if you're a beginner, really take this to heart and really try and, and master this because this is gonna help you in all other areas of your playing. Manny, what are you doing up here? Anyway, back to the lesson. So what I'm gonna show you guys is a really good exercise that's going to really build up the strength in your fingers and it's going to help coordinating your left and your right hand uh, together so you can play in time, you can play clean chords that that sound well and feel well to not only to you but to the listener. So what I'm going to show you is a very simple exercise and this is something that even somebody who has never once picked up a guitar in their life can start doing and start building the proper technique and strengthening the proper muscles in order to eventually start doing uh, guitar related things like playing music. Now this exercise has many names. Uh, I've heard it called the spider exercise, I've heard it called the ladder exercise, and there's tons of different uh, versions of, of all these exercises, but this one specifically is, is really good because it's super simple that anybody can, can just start doing right away. You can just pick up a guitar and start doing it and over time you can get better and faster and play it cleaner and it's, it's gonna really help develop your skills. So here, as I zoom in on the neck, all we're gonna be doing is working on these first four frets, starting with the first, second, third, and fourth. We have four fingers here on our fretting hand, so we're gonna assign each one of these frets to each finger. The first fret, all the strings are gonna be played with the first finger, the second fret, all the strings are going to be played with the middle finger. Same for the third and the ring finger, and same for the fourth and the pinky. So all we're going to do is, with our right hand, we're going to do all down strokes when we pick. So we're just going to hit the string and go down. We're not going to worry about hitting on the up stroke. That's going to be for another lesson. But for now, all we're going to do is just climb up from the first fret all the way up to the fourth in, uh, in ascending order. So. Here we go. Now, if you've never done this before, you might want to slow that down uh, an extreme amount until you're really comfortable with playing. And you, what you really want to focus on when you're doing this is proper technique with your hand. So, if you need to play it this fast, Don't worry about that. Just worry about playing it cleanly. When you get to the fourth string, or when you get to the fourth fret on the top string, just go down to the next string. And just go all the way up. 